What's going on guys? It's Coach B again. Uh, second week of the workouts. Uh, I'm very proud of the uh, work you guys have been putting in. I saw the videos. Keep it up. All the coaches love to see it. Before we start, I just want to say great job uh, social distancing. Being safe is most important you and your families. Uh, hopefully we get back on the field soon and we'll start. The first exercise we're going to do today is an inverted push-up. So you're going to go push-up position. You want your hands to be shoulder width apart. Then you're going to come down. And then you're going to raise your hands up to your elbows and your legs up, your toes up. That's one. So up, down, up, down, up, down. Again, we're going to be doing these exercises for 45 seconds to a minute. The second exercise we're going to do is another uh, variation of a push-up. If you have a chair at your house, anything really to lean on, you're just going to put your feet up against it, your hand shoulder width apart again, and down. Again, 45 seconds to a minute. If you gotta take a five second, 10 second break, that's okay, just get right back to it. The next exercise we're gonna do is the last variation of a push up. It's more for your tricep, this one. So you're gonna make a diamond with your, uh, your fingers like this. You're gonna come up, your chest is gonna try to hit the middle of that diamond. One, two, keep your back straight. Don't have your butt in the air, back straight, down, good. 45 seconds to a minute, next exercise. The next exercise we're gonna do is a uh, push up to a plank. So you're gonna go push up position again, shoulder width apart. Then you're gonna come down to a plank, up to a push up. Down to a plank, up to a push up. Down to a plank, up to a push up. 45 seconds to a minute, then take a break. The next exercise we're gonna do is for forearms. So you're gonna hold your bat out right here, top of the bat to grip, keep your thumb up. You can keep it here, keep it straight out in front of you. I'm just gonna work on bringing the bat up. You're gonna squeeze your forearm. Try not to strengthen your forearms here. Do this for a minute for your right arm, then take a break and switch. Do a minute with your left arm. And then a third variation you can do for another minute is uh, you can just hold the bat out like this. Come up and squeeze. Down, come up and squeeze. Down, come up and squeeze. Obviously, your bat isn't that heavy, but the whole purpose of the exercises is strengthening your forearm and your grip. So it's really just working on squeezing when you come up. All the way down, squeeze, all the way up. A minute, a minute, and a minute. Again, there's only limited uh, stuff we can do for upper body. I tried to think of as uh, many things as I could. So next, we'll do three things for core, and you guys will be good. So you're gonna keep your legs out in front of you. You're gonna interlock your hands. Then you're gonna go left, right, left, right, left, right left right remember to squeeze the whole time 45 seconds to a minute then stop the next exercise you're going to complete is called a v-sit you don't want to keep your hands out here because it's really easy to do this try to keep your hands out in front of you or to the side or in front of you oh, bring it in 45 seconds to a minute you'll be good the next exercise you're to complete is you're going to go into a push-up position or a straight plank the objective is to try to bring your left knee to your left elbow. It's working on your obliques. So one, one, left to left, right to right. 45 seconds to a minute, then stop. The last exercise you're gonna complete, your feet are gonna be in the air. You're gonna try to reach up to your toes, squeeze your stomach the whole time. It's working on your lower abdominal. 45 seconds to a minute, and then you're done. Again, uh, myself and the other coaches are really proud of you guys doing the work at home. Uh, doing the exercises, posting the pictures, posting the videos. Uh, whenever we get back in the field, I have 100% uh, confidence everyone's going to be ready to uh, work. And uh, that's it, guys. I'll see you next week.